Hello neighbors, it's Brad here at eTrailer and today we're taking a look at installing the Takancha T1 trailer wiring harness and this is going to be a four pole and that way you can hook up to your trailer or your lights on any accessory with your 2022 Hyundai Tucson. Now, if you plan on pulling trailers, having four pull wiring is a necessity because to operate the lights on the back of the trailer, you're gonna need to plug into this. That way you get your running lights, your turn signals and brake lights on the back of the trailer, keeping you safe and legal. Now, luckily this is a super easy one to do. You're just simply going to plug it in, zip tie up and mount up your module. And really all that's left to do is use your plug. Uh, now this one here, uh, you can pick up a bracket to mount this up but really the best way to do with four poles is you can just route it over your safety chain loop, cap the dust cover, and it's gonna hold it in place and you'll be ready to use it whenever you need it. Now this can be done in your garage or on your driveway within about five minutes, pretty easy to do. Um, so let's take a look at that and get yours installed. You're going to be happy to hear that this is going to be a super easy installation. And if you've pulled the harness out of the packaging, you'll probably realize that because it's just simply one plug and then really all we have to do is zip tie this up to where it's nice and clean so you can head underneath your vehicle and look for this plug now sometimes they're going to be attached up a little bit um, but what you're going to do here is you'll see this dummy plug it's just a cap that goes on top of it which is nice it keeps it clean and we're just going to take this end of our harness plug this in and then I'm going to go ahead and get this all kind of uh, zip tied up. Another thing that we want, want to do is make sure that this is in a spot where it's not going to rattle around. And ideally, we don't want to store it like this. That way, if water gets in here, we don't want that pooling. So having this portion hang down is a little bit safer option. So I'm going to get mine kind of zipped up and show you how it looks. So I began by putting my four pole. I just use the dust cap to loop it on the safety chain loop and that way it stays in place. And you can see where I'm cutting my zip ties. I just zip tied it up to the top of the hitch and that makes a nice easy path over to our plug. And I just kind of routed it this way here and bundled it all up. Now you can see this is gonna hold up, no problem. Our module here is loose. Now in the kit, there is a self-tapping screw as well as a double-sided tape. Um, and you're gonna wanna stick it to a flat surface again so it's not rattling around. Um, I'm gonna do both. Uh, might as well, that way if this ever it becomes not sticky over time, that self-tapping screw is gonna keep it in place. So I'll go ahead and just peel this. And then this nice flat surface here will allow that to stick. And then as far as your self-tapping screw, that hole up there, I'll be using a quarter inch socket to get that drilled in. So now that that is secure, all that's left to do is check to make sure that our wiring's working properly. Now I'll be testing our wiring by running through the light sequence using a four pole tester here. We have these available at e-trailer. It's really nice because it keeps it specific to the vehicle. The other option is to hook up to your trailer and check the lights to make sure that they're transmitting to the trailer. But you also wanna make sure that your trailer has proper wiring as well. Otherwise you can get a false negative. So I'm gonna hop in the vehicle, I'll run through the light sequence and we should see it working here. So I'm gonna start by using my running lights. Next we'll do our left turn signal then our right turn signal, and then finally the brakes. Now with everything working properly, all that's left to do is hook up to our trailer and get the towing. And that was a look and installation of the Takancha T1 trailering wiring harness, which is a four pole on a 2022 Hyundai Tucson.